Hey folks, Mike Parsons here with Bluegrass with Friends. Today we're working on some beginning fiddle stuff. So what we're going to do is just do some bowing exercises here. I think we've already showed you how to hold the bow. Well, here's how you hold the bow. Uh, I have the bow laying across my fingers inside of my first knuckle here on my index finger. And that's, I think that's the important thing. The, uh, this is how I get pressure on my bow by pushing down with this finger. And if you're out here on the tips of your fingers, you can't push down as much. So if I have uh, this finger pretty much wrapped around the bow and I'm able to push down with this finger, in this case I'm pushing sideways, then that gives me the control that I need. <laughs> push down. I really don't need these other two fingers. Put them down if you want. But how I really bow is like this. Two fingers. Now that'll get me kicked right out of violin lessons, but this is fiddling, so okay. Okay, so one way to kind of get this grip going is to put the bow up on your shoulder here, and then you can wrap that finger around. It kind of helps to do that. So, oh. That's for the bow hold. Now, first thing we're going to start with here is just uh, what we call one long bow. It's called a whole note. It takes four counts. And so we're going to go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. So that's one bow per string. One, two, three, four, one. So that is actually the hardest thing. One long bow for four counts. One, two, three, four. What you're doing is it's speed and pressure that you put on the bow. So if you put too much pressure and move slowly, you get this spooky Halloween door thing going on. So that's too much pressure. Okay. You can add more pressure to keep the bow moving. So anyhow one bow per string and then we're going to do two bows per string so this ends up being a half note Three quarter notes, so you see the pattern here one, two, three, four, and then run, pony, run, pony is what we're going to do. But now, right now, we're on three, and so that's going to be three quarter time, three quarter notes. Notice that my bow's moving a lot faster now. each one of these techniques until you get good at it and then move on to the next now four quarter notes So we've got one, two, three, four, and now we're going to do what we call run pony. And you can think of it as a half note and two quarter notes. So we'll just think of it at that. Two counts on a half note. going to increase that run pony thing and here well what I probably should do 
is get my metronome and show you how this works. Hang with me here. Okay, right here I got a metronome, and I can turn this thing on. Right now it's at 116 beats a minute. I don't know if you can hear and see that. Okay, so if we're going... y'all can hear this or not I'd like to get it over here a little closer so you can hear it but what you do is you just increase your speed here by a couple notches and it goes a little bit faster and so now we got Okay, so you slowly increase your speed in that fashion until you're going like this. Now, the reason I love this run pony thing is because in order to go that fast, you have to really unlock your wrist. When you first start playing the fiddle, it's just this conscious effort of trying to make this thing smooth and... Uh, you just kind of got to let go and let the bow, you know, experience the, the bowling rather than try and do it and just let it happen. Okay, so that's kind of weird. But you get what I'm saying. It's just you got to let it go and just be like. So you see how loose your arm has to be. Okay, so the next thing you want to do is two strings with all those patterns. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Okay, and I'm gonna skip through these fast. Go. Just two bows on each note. So the thing is, just keep on bowing, have fun. Let me see. There's a couple other patterns. There's one pattern called Mississippi Hot Dog. It's four quarter notes and two half notes. Mississippi Hot Dog. So as many of these things as you can think of, it's just fun to play them. Mississippi Hot Okay, now get out there and get fiddling and have a good time doing it. Thanks a lot.